Good to know. What can you tell me about the Brotherhood's history? Dr. Vri in the main library. Can you tell me about yourself? I am Rhombus, head of the Paladins. I train those willing to learn. Can you teach me some stuff? Stuff? I could teach you how to fight, if you had any ability. But the High Elder decreed no training of new recruits until the threat of invasion passes. Why has he stopped the training? It takes too long. I spend my time improving those already trained. Arn, can I ask you a few more questions? Heard any good rumors? I do not put stock in rumors. Okay, fine. Thank you. Rhombus likes me. So I'm gonna go north and search for whatever destroyed the Brotherhoods of Steel recruits, or scouts, basically, to the north. You. You see a lone traveler in the distance. Greetings, traveler. What brings you out this far? Just wandering. I see, much like myself then. Oh, you're not from the one of the communities out there. I wander from place to place, make a living with music and a little bit of tinkering work. What kind of work do you do? Mostly a little electrical and mechanical tinkering. I helped John Cat Town with her lights and showed the people in Shady Sands a better design for the stoves. Can you direct me to a nearby settlement? What kind of music do you sing? Oh, mostly old folk songs and some Celtic music. It's a change of pace. I see. What else do you do? Well, it's good to meet you. men in power armor approaching you. The captain. Oh, I recognize you. You the, the Brotherhood. Some may trust you, but I do not. State your business. I wanted to see a friendly face. <laughs> Yes, not everyone in the Brotherhood likes Brother Ted Bundy. They'll all grow to love him. Or probably die. Oh shit, super mutants, no! Okay. North and West is dangerous. I'm gonna head back. And so far as to head back to downtown and check out that underground place I found in the warehouse that is booby trapped to the teeth. And I also want to keep looking for the caravan. That, well, what's making the caravans disappear from here in the hub? I thought I was supposed to find it with the Brotherhood, but I didn't find anything. So let me go talk to Beth again. Can I ask you some questions? What's the word on the street about the missing caravans? Some people think water merchants are responsible, but I don't think so. I think it was the, that darn death bar, maybe the people over at the Brotherhood of Steel. I'm going with the death bar because I don't, I don't know where they are. The death claw is the most evil thing to rise out of the ashes of the war. Some say it's a powerful ghost in form. Know anything else about the Death Claw? Well, I know this old mutant in Old Town named Harold. He's seen it. He's the only one that's seen it and lived. 
the only one that's seen it and lived. Uncle Slappy over in Old Town talks about it sometimes, but he's just a crazy old fool. I don't know who the hell Uncle Slappy is, but let me go find him. Because I've talked to Harold and he doesn't seem to mention anything. Thanks, I'll check it out. Go to downtown. Okay, so this is Slappy. The crazy dude outside. Oh, pretty, pretty stuff. Why is the moon? Beth told me to talk to you about the death claw. Beth, Beth. You shot Beth like Harold. You talk. Harold. Harold tell you story. Slappy then help. Okay, I'll talk to Harold first. No wonder I never found this. I, I just thought he was a crazy dude. Maybe I never talked to Beth about it. Oh, I thought hey, I had. it's you again. Hey man, here's Anything 20. I can do for you? I need info on the death bar to hear you're the man. Ooh, that thing. Friend, that is Nightmare City. Why the hell are you asking about that? Gonna kill it. Okay. Well, that's like a damn big man is what it is. Got spikes and claws that can cut through the heaviest armor. But don't let the size fool you. It's quick. Any weaknesses? Well, from what I've heard... Maybe whack it in the head. I'd try the eyes. Of course, there's a problem there. What kind of problem? You can't look at him. It is said the death claw can hypnotize just by looking. Then it walks up and boom, you're it. Hey, Good thanks. Luck to you. You're going to need it. I thought he'd already told me that. Maybe tripping, though. Okay, Slappy, now tell me what's up. Uh, I talked with Harold. The Death Claw sounds pretty nasty. What can you tell me about it? Death Claw, Death Claw, do, do, Death Claw. Come on, what do you know about the Death Claw? Death Claw, scary, really scary. Looks neat, though. Wanna see it? You can take me to the Death Claw? Yeah, Death Claw, Death Claw. Going to see the Death Claw. Just shut up and take me there. So we're taken to a dark cavern, God knows where, around the city, well, around the hub, I guess. These, eggshell, oh, they're death pot eggs. Hopefully there aren't too many, I can't deal with too many. Oh, seems to be only one, and a dying mutant. This is a chance, really? Damn. Ian, don't lunge for it. That's a bad idea. Myself, I lost my next turn. No freaking way. Okay, guys, defend me with your lives. Oh, don't shoot dog meat. I'm just a piñata for them to whack. I can take one more hit from this death claw. I'm gonna switch my weapon and get swinging. Come on, team. We got it. Now you die.
don't take any damage from some of his hits. He's taking a beating. Critical. Holy shit, I'm gonna die. Okay, let me use all the stim packs I can. That finally, of course, he won't have anything on him. Let's go see what this body has. You see, a, oh, it's a dying mutant, not a dead mutant. It was so fast, my brothers were gone, could not help. Who are you? I, I am, I can't remember. I was the leader of it maybe my hollow disc the mutant weakly hands you a bloody hollow disc where do you come from we we are scouting for primes come from from the northwest who sent you father where are you father yes master the mutant breathes his last breath and collapses so he gave me a hollow tape and he has a radio. Interesting. I already have a radio. I'll take it to sell it. Let's take a look at this hollow disc. Mutant transmission. Message sent. Base, this is scavenger team. Two, come in. Over. Message received. We are reading you loud and clear. Go ahead. Over. Message sent. We've collected your four males, two females, and their supplies from the caravan. They're not too badly contaminated. Tell the lieutenant that we're sending them ahead. They might be able to survive the process. We're going to wait here for a few more days. Message received. Roger that. We are concerned. Where any casualties occur during the acquisition over. That's just sent negative. Another clean sweep base also tells scavenger team one that we run across the same problem they had. One of our scouts did not return from his perimeter patrol. A few of our other scouts reported that there was something big and fast seen near our camp last night. I'll be checking it out personally at 0600 hours tomorrow morning. Over. I should have received copy. We'll be awaiting your report. If possible, try to capture it. The master would be very pleased. Over. Okay, so the master seems like the big bad guy here. That's a leader of the super mutants that are in that northwestern base I've quickly found before getting murdered by mutants. Let's head back and See if that's all the info we need. The mutants have been attacking the caravans, not the Death Claws. If anything, the Death Claws have been attacking the mutants. Now let's see. We're gonna go to downtown. Wait, it is here. Fargo Traders. We go talk to the boss. Well, what do you have? Well, I found out what's been taking the caravan. Really? Who? It's these big mutant guys. What would mutants want with our caravans? 
I don't know, but they seem to be taking the humans prisoners. What, do I look a crate shy of a load? Did you even see the death claw? In there, I saw that, killed it. You, you killed it? Well, I, uh, um, uh, where did these mutants come from? I don't know yet, but they have an outpost in the mountains. An outpost? Well, um, well, uh, I'll have to talk to the committee. Yeah, yeah, they'll know what to do. Uh, done and done. G get out, because uh, I got stuff to do, okay? I think the buddy. Whatever. Hey, you. Oh, howdy, my how, how can I help you? I found out what happened to the missing caravans. Mutants destroyed our caravans? That's almost as good as the one about the death claw. Well, check out this hollow disc. I got it off one of the radio mutants. Hey, I know how to use one of those. Butch got some gizmo from some scout from the Brotherhood a long time ago. I can read these things, let me see. Sorry, I didn't believe you. This does not bode well for the good guys. Well, here's your 500 HUD bucks. Hell, make it 800. And thanks for the information. If you need any more work, you will always be welcome. Nice, so now I can do caravans with those, with the Fargo traders, I believe. I double check that. You need more jobs? Of course. You don't need to talk to me, just talk to a caravan driver. Who's the, oh, this guy right here. Okay, perfect. We'll do that later. Let me go back to Old Town. Check out that underground base I found. Oh shit, should put my weapon. I haven't seen me yet, or... Maybe they're friendly. Hello? What do you want? I'm... I'm yourself. Tell me how it's a circle. If you're lucky, you'll consider yourself one of us by the end of the day, at home, part of the future, you know? Tell me about Decker? We don't discuss Mr. Decker in polite company. Okay, anything to sell? Ooh, I could use those. For my companion. Not pretty sure what's going on here. I'm a little afraid to take their things. They to attack me. Who are you? Bloody the fine job making it through Lossy the defenses, mate. Of the thieves, I'm rather yo. impressed. Toss me your name. I'm Ted Bundy. Quite pleased to make your acquaintance, actually. For now. Let's get the other bit of politeness taken care of, shall we? What the bloody, bloody... Bloody hell are you doing here? Um, can I join the circle? Oh, how nice. A joiner. Well, you've worked hard enough for a look-see. But if you really want to join, then you'll have to take the second test. Um, what was the first? We haven't figured it out yet, have we? The first test was just getting here. That's the only reason I'm considering you. What's the next test? It's so, so simple. In the Heights, you'll find Darren Hightower's home all plump and ripe for the picking. Are you ready for life? Do you accept the challenge? I'm ready. That's the spirit, mate! Just talk to Jasmine in the room outside this chamber. She'll give you details, a map, and a few little goodies to help you on your way. But remember, if you even think about ratting us out to the cops, we'll be a memory before they arrive. But enough gloom. Cheerio, good luck, and ta-ta. Okay. So I found the Thieves Guild. Is Arena and, and Daggerfall? Made before Fallout 1? Is this just like a reference to, to the other games? Remember the release date of Fallout 1. 
didn't ever play it much. This is the first time I'm actually getting pretty far in the game. So he wants me to steal. Oh, what did I do? I need to talk to that woman. Oh. The lady forgot something. Cleo. Tell me about Loxley. He's the boss. What else do you want to know? Tell me about Decker. Wait, do I... I'm so confused. Talk to you. Okay. Welcome to the Thieves Guild. I'm Jasmine. I'm here to help make your infiltration of the Darren Hightower State as painless as possible. Hightower State is located in the Heights. It has a minimum of two guards on duty at all times. The necklace is probably in a strong box, which often has some minor traps. So be careful. Here are some lockpicks and a couple of flares to make your job a little easier. And a bottle of Nuka Cola. Try not to kill Mr. Hightower. He's one of our favorite people. You got all that? What do you mean by favorites? Well, he's been our benefactor on many an occasion. If you kill him, someone smarter may take his place. We wouldn't like that. <laughs> uh, Mr. Decker's the guy from the Maltese Falcon, I believe. So we need to steal... a necklace? From someone in the Heights. That is that really aggressive place to the west where the guards shoot you if you're going at night. I think that's sort of where we're going. Let's head on over to the Merchant District. Actually, let's stop by the library. Because I know she sells books, but last time I was here, I wasn't in a spot to read loads of books. What do you have for sale? She has some good books. I really need, actually. I'll come back later. Maybe a couple scouts books? Okay, two books or some drugs and the frag grenade. But she's gonna have fun. I'm gonna wait till night time and we're gonna go in and heal. Well, get that necklace. Hopefully. Night time. Let's go into the heights. After sundown, nobody is allowed in this area. The other guards won't even give you a warning. If they catch you, they'll attack you. You better get back downtown while your head is still attached to your neck. Sorry, I'll be on my way, buddy. Actually, let us uh, sneak a bit. Oh. Hurry up, get in, get in, get in. Oh, shit. Okay, you're gonna have to die now, buddy. Sorry about that. Get him, dog meat. Get him. Ammo, really. Uh, 
we just send the fight here. Oh, yes, yes. Okay, let's get in here. Looking for a necklace. I'm to sneak, I guess. Let's go this way first. Hopefully it's not in the room and I have to, like, run away before they kill me. Anything in the desk? Guys, can you guys get out of here, please? Possible that there are traps here. Find nothing searching strong box for traps. How does the lockpick not work with this? Multiple attempts to unlock strong box has set off of the trap. Ooh, found the necklace. Okay, let's get the hell out of here then. Knock at the thief circle. I'm going to talk to Mr. Locks himself. Oh, how nice to see you again. Do you have a little something for me? Here's the necklace. Ha <laughs> ha! Well done! Congratulations! You're now a member of the world-famous Thieves' Circle! Let's get Jasmine over here and throw a topper, shall we? I don't know what that means, but hell yeah, let's do it. Jasmine? Well done, lad. Here's your reward. Jasmine gives you 3,000 bucks. By the way, here's a little something extra to help you in your future felonious uh, forays. Jasmine hands your set of electronic lockpicks. Oh, what is that? Electronic lockpicks. Watts electronics. Finger stuff electronic lockpick for defeating electronic locks. And security devices. Holy shit, that's useful. Where would I use that? Probably... I need to go back to the glow. I only barely scratched the surface of that place. And I bet there's some cool shit there if I can... get down further and live. And now with an electronic lock pick, I can definitely make my way through. I even had a, a key card, a yellow key card for it. Pretty sure I still have it somewhere. And here it is, yellow key pass. I think the next adventure is gonna be in the glow. Just going to do a few more quests here. I'm going to go see what Mr. Decker needs me to do. I could use some work that pays well. Erwin, he has a name. Oh boy, can't you leave me be? I have enough problems on my hands. Problems? Maybe I can help you. This is a tragedy. Nobody believes me. Nothing is the way it used to be. Wait, none. I don't know how I added those words there. I have a small farm outside of town. A few days ago, a bunch of raiders appeared out of nowhere and now use my home as their camp. They killed Pugsley, my donkey, and they threatened to kill me if I ever dare come back. Just tell me where they are and I'll take care of the rest. Really? That you would do that? You know, I don't dare go there anymore. Why don't you come back and let me know when it's safe? 